morning everyone lovely sunrise we're gonna jump on this one had a dig little dig through before I thought oh well I better go and grab the camera show you what I'm gonna get out of this we got some bottles here we got some building material here too so I might find some wire we got a couple of bottles here there's a box down here that I already got out. It's got some screws in it, fixtures. So we're going to chuck that in there. Not often I get to see the sunrise. So it's good to see the sunrise. Always got my head in a bin or something like that. So that's why I don't see the sunrise. But do that. Put that down there. Have a good look in here. Oh, a bit of copper. Take that. I've got nothing to cut that off. Take the whole lot. Small bit of copper. What else is on? Oh, another piece here. Copper and brass. Don't be separate like that. Get on up here. A little bit of wire there. Oh, good. We'll take all of that. We'll take that. For sure. All of that. All the goodies. That's the good stuff. Number one. Once we strip it out, it'll be number one. Steel. Oh, geez, it's going down to the abyss. Oh, that one's been stripped. Stripped. But let something chunky down there, too. Brackets. Just jump on in here. There we go. Glue on there. Probably is. No, it's not glued on there. It's not glued on there. Hmm. Just thinking, everyone, don't worry. Just thinking. Got a few projects on and fulfilled at home. I'm just thinking. A lot of the PVC piping down pipe. Now, a bit of that, a couple of bits of steel, we'll take that. In that one. Oh, I find out what's on the end of that bloody piping. It was worthwhile grabbing. Stuck in the box. There we go. 
free. Feels heavy. Oh yeah, we'll take that bit too. A little bit of brass and copper on the end. down there yet. You know what? I'll put all the bloody small pieces in that. Where that stuff is. That was a good shot. <laughs> Copper. 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 <laughs> I think that'll do this one. Get on to some more ducks and everything else there. <laughs> yep. I think we got it. I reckon we got it all. Geez, that was a good shot too. Squash it down. Take more in. Put that back in there. Ah, so that's a good effort. Where's all our small pieces? Plastic. Yeah, plastic. 
bounces back. <laughs> oh, that's me ring. Thought it was a bit of rubbish. Anyway, onwards and upwards of the sunrise. Started visiting at a photo that taken space street flying through the skies and battles I just got a shock. Come out and there's a bag in the back. Damn, where'd that come from? He must have come out. Oh well, that's alright, I don't mind. Now we've got to get into that. So just bear with me and um, got to get the jacket off. It's getting a bit hot. It's a nice hot jacket. It's got fleecy line on the inside. So just bear with me. All geared up, ready to go. No sleeves. <laughs> oh, i got sleeves. Look, i got sleeves. <laughs> anyway, got some sleeve. We'll get into it. Ooh, that's pretty. That's got some heavy stuff in there. Probably only food scraps in this one. Oh, there we go. There's one there. There's one there. Doesn't want to stay there. Feels like there's one there. No, it's not. No. It's empty. Right, we'll start into this one. Get into the easy one. First of all, that. Getting done. I've got to do that bag, don't forget. Looking there. Not open. What have we got here? Bit of tuna? Tunky tuna, is it? Yeah. Chunky style tuna in olive oil blend. We'll take that one. What other stuff we're going to find in here? Oh, yeah, we'll take that bottle. Those three. I'll take that one as well. I'll just pull the straw out, of course. Straws are not accepted.
Dann. What's that? Full bottle of lemonade. Pretty much. It is. Lemonade? It's unopened. I can't see. Where's this light? Give me some light, he says. That has not been opened. No, that's a full bottle of lemonade. <laughs> that's going in the front. That one going in the front. He's up there. That's that. Get rid of that stuff. Nothing worse than get rid of that. Get that stuff in you. Yeah, you better open that. She's just about on the bus side, that one. Put it in the bag. We won't empty that onto the ground. It makes a mess here. That one there. That into there. Big bottles in this one. Oh well, when I take out, there's less trash down to the landfill. Well, it's not trash when I get it. Turn it into old hard, hard cash. Especially the bottle coming out by the sound of it. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, pop a box. They go pop. When you spread on them, that's why I call them pop a boxes. I'll give those a bottle. That's a no. He won't go. Nothing in that bag, but looks for it. No. Oh yeah. Our phone tie. You must pass it up. Drag that out. Get rid of that stinky fungi shit. Come on, French. There we go. Get rid of that. I'm going to try and fit one bin here today. Try. Ooh, you breaky breaky. Very breaky, that one. Oh, that fluff. To this heavy one first to know whether we're gonna need it. to have one bin or two. Oh, pizza boxes! I hate these things. Is that a bit of steel? That is a bit of steel. Oh, there's another one. Just about threw it away. Hang him down, boy. Gun Luke, not too bad. The storm went so your huts are going well. Oh, yeah, 
<laughs> yeah, we know. Yeah, it's only what a couple of weeks away. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Don't tell me that. <laughs> All right. Well, you like to have them finished before then? Yeah. I'd like to. <laughs> you can't see it happening. No. Just put it in there. Notice there was a bin in that car. Yeah, 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 because your latch is broken. Oh, it's because of the, this colder weather that steel moves a bit. It shrinks. Yeah, well, yeah, it goes one way. <laughs> and then the afternoon it's fine, but I've just got to make a bigger latch for it. Yeah, make a bracket. Yeah. He's the owner of this place. Yeah. We may have to use this bin here for the second bin. Didn't want to, but we may have to. <coughs> Can't see much in there except for that V. Oh, there's a can. They don't go through those things. No, we might be lucky. We might be lucky to fit it all in here. Squash it over the back over there. Get up and jump on the damn thing. That'll fix it. Get all these glass in here, we might have room. We're getting there, we're getting there. And I went down a hole. I knew the car was there for something. <laughs> Make a good step. Now we'll be able to have this one bin. No, that's not our foil. It's a um, wine bag. Beer bottle there. box. Uh, there we go, got the straw out. Only got a few in here. Straws off. Hang on to that label. Just in case you find one hasn't got a label. How big of a label was that? That's a fairly big label. Where's that calling from? Oh, I scratched it! I scratched it! Where was that bottle? Damn! Grab that one. Oh, I don't know where that bottle was. Say. 1.5 is it? Yes, 1.5. I've got to grab that bottle. Put that label back on it. Where'd you go, boy? Where'd you go? Where'd you go, you cut them, boy? Damn, I've lost it now. Yeah. 
too much in there. Oh, there it is. That's the one. Bag it and tag it. Bag it and tag it. There we go. We've tagged it. They never seem to fall out of there. We'll blow that back up and band-aid it. <laughs> That's what we do. We band-aid things. It's got the original barcode, original bottle. Can't go wrong with that. We just band-aid them. That's all we do. No one can go cook on me. Doing the right thing, putting a band-aid on it. Not an actual band-aid you put on yourself, but yeah. Just the terminology. Jeez, that's a big word for me. Terminology. I've never used that word before. Damn! That's got some weight in that one. Can't lift it. Okay. Doing pretty well and put it all in one beam. What did you jump on it? As you will see. It's a damn good start for the morning, you know. I don't mind it when it's like this. Get 
you know what? That broken bump is right there. We might be able to band aid him up. Band aid that one up. Get it chipping it up. Do this. <laughs> yeah, we'll tip him up and make sure we get him in that plate there. Give me the bottle tops. Cigar. Look at that. No mess, no fuss. Piece of glass. Alright. So we'll band aid that. Got our full bottle of lemonade. Got all that copper and a tin of tuna so we'll put this one out put him out for the lad look at that that's a full bin i'll put a strap on that so it doesn't open when i top with the good old sharky down here good old sharky nice sharky he smiles at everyone behind me <laughs> anyway onwards and upwards and we'll put these back we've got a wheel off Put him back on. Anyway, you know, been over, got the barbecue one. Empty him out first. That's that, we can put that in there. I'll go through this one first. Pull him up. Ooh, that sounds promising. Yes, he know. Yes, he know. Yes, he, yes, he, yes, he. Oh, yes. We'll take all of that. All of that good. Leave it down there. Duck fat. Never heard of it. I'm going to put it in there. Make a bit of room instead of putting it in the back. The alfoil there, get rid of the string off it. We just about got our block from yesterday. Almost pressed up. Oh, the truckies they ate on me. I didn't share. No one shares with me. Never mind. I found freebies, that's a good thing. Not always. But I don't. I'm thinking that.
tray. Oh, it's not a tray, it's stealth work. Take that. Move for bread, don't want. Then on the bottom of it, then. Oh, don't go for the bread. Right out here. Not unless I know it's fresh out of a bakery or something like that. Okay, bring it out. Get that alfoil out of there. Take that bit. Burned up and charred, but I'll take it. She was dirty alloy. That's what it'll happen when I put all my um, compressed alloy through. It'll go through this dirty alloy. I hope anyway. They, um, yeah, they got a hole in them. I'll take them for a rag. Got a hole in the bump. But I'll take them for a rag, definitely. Need a few rags. Need a bit of wire. Bit of fish you in here, too. Yeah, we'll take all of the fish. How about we leave it all in the bag, take the crap out. Take the junk out. We'll take all of those, take all, all the non-necessity items out. Put that in the front. We'll put it up the back for now. Got bins to go through. That's that. Right now we can put it straight in there. I might take this little bin along with me. It might be a help. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll put that in there. Just in case we find the label. And we'll be able to band aid it up. I'm going the wrong way, man. Think about it. Think about what you're doing. Let's jibber jabber and get on with it. Donate that. 
again in the kitty getter. That's that one. Oh, push him back, line him up. That's got a battery in it. Devil's this, I've never seen this one before. It's on there. See what these things are here. There's another one. Casings, aluminium. Aluminum? And aluminum? Yeah, yeah, that. <laughs> Everyone else over in, over in the other big land of the world says aluminum. We say aluminium. Aluminum, aluminium, same stuff. I don't know. It's not in there. At least they went through a few. Look at what we got there. Oh, that's a bit old. Now, for everyone, one, I did get a comment too. Uh, why do I put it over into another bin and leave one empty? I find it so much easier. You, know, you empty one out and you can offload, offload, offload. So much easier. Doesn't matter whether it's going to be uh, half empty. The truck's going to still pick it up anyway. It's just not as heavy, that's all. That's all it is. It's just not as heavy. Bog roll. and I have seen him pick up this bin with those. So, recycling, there's none in this part. It's just as easy to have these bins out for me. It's a bit of a shame where I've got to go through all the time, clean it out. Not much I can do about it. Smash. 
Smash, crash, bang. Never have a lash. this one back. Put the barbecue one back, so it'll be onwards and upwards up there. Look at that. I didn't bring that bin along. Oh, we got a citronella candle holder. Leave all that tea bag stuff there. We'll put that up the back. That sun is in a shocking spot. Grab that out of there for now. Get rid of the infestation for a second. We'll have to dig it back out of there though, that's the only thing. I want this is, that bin is empty. It's just been chucked on top. before they go to the bottom. Yeah, there's a big hole there. Put that down there, that down there. That way. That one is a no. I'll probably have to look at it again. Grab that bag. Oh, that is full. Pretty good. Alright. Put 
put the box back in right way up this time oh it might get caught That. Get that in there. I've got an ant crawling in my ear. Bear with me. No more? No, that's it. Got rid of him. Back to business. And that we just get rid of the crud. Ooh, that's still got some in it. Take that home. That'd be a surprise for you. Get rid of that crud. Get rid of that one. You should be just about able to empty all of that out. Isn't that amazing how the milk blows up? Get off me. Ah, whichever, mate. Doesn't matter. Oh, yeah, you can suck it in if you like. Don't be digging it out. I'll get it. That's all good. <laughs> Thanks for that. No label. Sticky. I'll cut the sticky or I'll put it on the ground. Ah, it doesn't want to get off me. <coughs> shake, shake, shake. Shake the Buddha. Shake, shake, shake. Shake the Buddha. Is that the other one? Is it empty? Yes, it's empty. Mm. Probably only find two scraps in this one now. Just a guess. Ah, we've got a couple. How are you going, love? Pretty good. Can't complain. Yeah, chuck them in there, thank you. I didn't wake you, did I? No, no. Oh, that's all right then. Be recycled. It's got grass in it. Food scraps. Crying shame that I've got to go through that. Hey, that's the good grass. What are they throwing Kaikuyu away for? Nothing in that. 
more food scraps. Hey guys? They're putting them in the wrong section. Yeah, there's food scraps in this, the whole lot, mate. Even grass. So don't blame yourselves. Yeah. I'm mainly after all that stuff anyway. Oh. <laughs> aluminium, aluminium foil trays, all that sort of thing. Oh, yeah. Bit of a recycler myself. Oh, right. Big time recycler. Yeah. Old washing machines. Yeah. White goods, all those sort of things, yeah. yeah. I get what I can, when I can. I've got two pickups, I've oh, got a, another pickup today. What are I going to do? That's got gas in it. <laughs> yeah, that's got gas in it. And it's thrown away. We use those for cooking. Because we're in a caravan ourselves. No. Uh, so yeah. Been in the caravan for oh full time. Have you? Yeah. Oh, you really About, need, no, 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 we're I'm caretaker of the boat club in Griffith. Oh. So hey. been there for going on two years. Oh yeah. That's one fifty. Get off me. Oh, uh, mate. There's just too much to keep up with. <laughs> That's all it is. I've got too much to poke a stick at even. I've got to do a, um, see, with my run of anything I get like this stuff, I can dispose of it in Griffith. Um, anything like washing machines, that sort of thing, I have to take it to Wagga. Oh, right. Because there's no real uh, scrap metal dealer in Griffith. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, because I get all the copper yeah, yeah. wire and all that sort of thing too, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's the thing. There's a lot of it. Like when you pick up, uh, people look at a fridge. They just see a fridge. Yeah. There's a lot of copper wire in the motor. You got copper wire in in the actual cord. Uh, then you've got copper piping. And sometimes some of the cores inside behind the freezer section are aluminium. Yeah. Money. Yeah. And then you've got the whole unit. It goes through as um, normal scrap metal. So yeah, what I do with those is I lay them down. Once I've stripped it all out, what I can get out of it without pulling too much styrofoam out, um, because it's a biohazard. Yeah. Well, I think it's a biohazard, bio even though it's just that expander foam stuff. Um, I, what I do is I lay them on their backs, leave the doors up and fill it with scrap steel. Yeah. Make a load. Yeah. So yeah, so far I've got a few. I'm starting to scratch my head, how am I going to get it to Wagga? <laughs> I've got about four or five of them I'm going to take to Wagga yet, plus another one of these cars. Oh yeah. It's a task and a half. I went and bought another one of these so I could have parts. So I've just got to scrap it out and, and uh, get the parts off it because uh, it, it ran into a tree on the driver's side. It's collapsed the whole front end in and broke the CV joint and yeah. all that, so yeah. But anyway, it's another day that I'm going to do. Uh, yeah, my son-in-law does a fair bit of mechanics, and he keeps buying cars just for parts. Yeah, yeah, well I thought about, because the back end is, you know, basically good from, oh, from here on, she's pretty good, but I thought about with the other one that I'm scrapping out, chop it off here and make a, a trailer. Yeah. I thought, oh, how much work am I going to gonna have to do for that? Because <laughs> it's got a good, good axle on. It's just a straight axle underneath. Yeah. Because yeah. it's front wheel drive. Oh, yeah. But oh, yeah. um, in the other one, uh, the one that I'm talking about, it's got a good motor in it. I could probably get $1,000 for the motor. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. 
little projects that everyone thinks they can get around to doing. Whether they can do it or not, that's like me. Uh, oh, that's got it on it. Uh, heading off today, are you? No, no, we only got you yesterday. Oh, okay. Fair enough. And then you can just go home again. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> That is that done then dusted. Uh, we'll probably empty that one today too. Now the thing is with the recycling, there is no real recycling here because I've seen the truck pick this bin up with this stuff. It all goes in the one hopper. Uh. And that's the problem. Yes, people do the right thing by putting in, in recycling in here, paper and all the cans and that sort of thing, but see that that's not recyclable, it's explosible. Yeah. And they've got it in there. Some of, I, that's what I do find. Yeah. Um, and I have found there's not much recycling in the town itself. No. Because it all goes out to Collie see? Which is further out. Yeah. So, but I, don't, I haven't seen the recycling yeah. centre yeah. there. Setting up big recycling centres in Auburn, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot around there. Yeah, we're so. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're yeah. not far away. You ain't staying far away. Good old Andy. Yeah. He got a bit chatty, that fella. <laughs> oh, I didn't mind. Stood around there for a while. Well, that's going to go as scrap. Where's those clothes over there with the... That goes over there too. Sort it out as I go. A little bit. Yeah, mate. That rubbish, man. <laughs> you don't want these? Yeah, just sit down there. You sure? Yeah, yeah. It's all going in there anyway. Uh, you should have a sign on them. Recycling and rubbish. On where? On the bin. Um, problem. What? I tell this to everyone here. The truck picks up the yellow bin lid and this one on the same day. Yeah. Same truck? Same truck. Picks them both up. Don't recycle. That's it. No issues. Yeah, I know mate. <laughs> I see it too many times and that's why I get what I can out at the time. Yeah. Like I can't take wine bottles. No. Because they're not 10 cent. Yeah, I don't blame you. Sorry mate. That's no, all good. Yeah. <laughs> it's all good. Well, you got a couple of dollars back there. Oh, I got more than a couple of dollars. <laughs> you didn't see me load yesterday. No. This was full to there and then I had a wool pack on the back. Did you when you take it to Griffith? Yeah. Yeah, no I take it all to Griffith. Uh, I'm due to put through probably six or seven thousand units this week. You go have they got a big dump or you have to put it No, I put it through myself. I'd rather put it through myself that way I can see it count up. <laughs> <laughs> you can I can take it to Wagga uh, and you just pour it in and it counts it for you, but I've been stint on that. Oh, they do, yeah. you know, because it doesn't actually always scan them. No. So you miss out, and I'd rather stand there and see it count up. Yeah, true. So, yeah, I try and put what I can through recycling, what I can. Because I do re wash machines and all that sort of thing too. Oh, right. yeah. yeah, it's not just this, even aluminium foil trays. Yeah. I made up a press, we press them all together. I had a full washing machine. Right, I'd gutted the washing machine yeah. and, and just left the shell, had that full. Now I've got 15 kgs of aluminium trays. <laughs> it all adds up.
see today if I hit a video of him empty if I'm around. If I'm still here in time, I'm pretty early this morning. Uh, I'm not coming through here until about 11, 12 o'clock. I'll show you what I mean if he empties it today. He does empty these today. I do know that. But yeah, you'll understand what I mean. I just did one bin. I left one around these. We might be able to get him. I'll put the city and city and city. I will. I'll show you. Exactly. See what I see. Things behind the scenes that don't get shown. I don't record it either. So this one I will try to. How's he done there? There's no mean for tray in there. I'll take that one. Glove time change. You know what I mean? Getting a bit grotty. Um, caddy do in it, not doggy do, caddy do, but it would, it's not a dumb idea putting kitty litter in your bin, soaks up all the moisture, one problem is it sticks, hey, that's still got some in it, that's got a lot in it, take that, right, go through this one first, What's wrong with it? Oh, that's got a bit of mould on it. Pity I couldn't feed it to the birds here. Yeah, 
still be hard. Yeah. Second of Feb, that's why. Damn good place in there though. Yeah, no, we're gonna leave all that there. Seafood sticks, they're defrosted. Someone's moved out and left. Been open too. Nothing in that. Nothing in that. There. 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 We won't say what that is. It'll get emptied out later. People are just grubby. bloody and gross. Too lazy to go and do what it's supposed to be. You might as well have a tube inserted if they're going to do that. Have a bag behind me. At least that's more hygiene. Pretty good, as yourself. Didn't know who was still going to be there for a sec. Sure. Oh, there's the other half. That'll go with that one. Spinning man, have a look. Where is it? Come on. Stand out. Stand out from the crowd and give me a look. Ten cents, right there, small riding. What have we got here? What the hell have we got here? Jeez, that's a big bag. Big bag with some small bags inside. What are the small bags like? Oh, it's a new it's a, No, I don't want that there. Okay, it can go there. Got no use for it. One egg. One egg will take one egg. Is that a foil tray? It's certainly is not, but there's a can in it. Ooh, they had a breakage. Bet you they would have been crying over that one. I might take that. 
I've got better ideas for that. Sterilise it, <coughs> of course. There's a placemat. I'll take that too. Geez, we're not getting much today. Well, we're not finished. We're nowhere near finished. One more. One more. Ten. Oh, there's another place. Take this. Got a pair now. One for me, one for you. What the devil we got here? Oh, that's one of those moppy things. Bring you. I don't know what I'll use it for, but anyway. I've got no use for a lot of noise. Actually, I have got to use it. Use it on windscreen. This is another one of those. Oh no, they chopped it up, did they? No, they haven't chopped it up. This is another one. Get off me. That's a man on me. Ah, I better clean it up, everyone. Pull the old finger out of the bum. The old thing goes. Get a wriggle on. Get rid of all that fishing line. Over there. We'll go that way.
Next, onwards and upwards. Wow. Cut that out and be a twenty dollar bill. <laughs> How often would you find a twenty dollar bill in the in the bin? Never. <laughs> Hell no, you wouldn't find one at all. We got the whole carton in there. Well, that one went way down the bottom yonder in the abyss. Dig it out of the abyss. Oh, oh damn plastic. I tell you what. Cavity. Focused, everyone. Be focused. Do -do -do. Don't ring, phone. I don't want you ringing. Now, I wouldn't do that with my mats outside. I just roll them up. If it is a mat for outside, looks like it. Sweeping it up here. Yeah, well, everyone to their own. Right. Next. Just 
there. Let's find out what we got in this one. That's just empty bags. Bit of wire, I'll take that. Bit of steel wire, that will be okay. I'll take the tray. Pull the plastic off it. It's just a bit of steel wire. Put it in amongst all the other stuff. All the scrap steel. Toss over so I don't have to dig to the bottom of that. Okay, let's get a more there. Right here. Ooh, that's a full tub of grease, just about. I might salvage that grease. Damn, 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 damn. Let's get that bottle there. Get that bottle top. Bottle top, bottle top. I want to dig the dog food out of there. That's all. Dig the dog food out. Now, a bag to put this in. Mm. Nope. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Oh, I've got a bag here. I've got a bag here. Double bag it. This is a fair bit, fit a bit. <laughs> fair bit of grease. So we'll hang on to that. Put it in the bag. Take the grease. I can still put it in my grease gun. Alright. Go around the corner and find what, what else we're going to get. Right. Yeah, we'll get a little bit out of there. It's got al aluminium in it, I think. I'll do a test when I get home. Steel. If it is, I'll just put it in steel. Well, is that all you're going to give me? Me. Yeah, don't you fall out of there. Oh, there's another one. Give me that one. Put that in there. We'll have a looky. Let's go that way. Peekaboo. There's one. They're all in here. All in here. Comes our walkers. Is 
that easy. Oh no, let me know. Onwards and upwards we go. Over to those two. Well, well, well. Just got talking to the local butcher. Mind me rubbing my face. <laughs> I gotta deliver a bin there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's a good idea, that. They're going to save them for me, which is damn good for me. But anyway, they're on their local walk. I'm going to take that. Might be steel or something like that. Looks like a little antenna. <sighs> Drop a bin off next week. Nothing in that. Oh, we got the other half down there. That's what that was. Yeah, that's what that was. We'll poke that into that. That's what it was. So it won't matter if I don't pick it up for two weeks or so. That's that one. It's free advertisement, really. Oh, they got 10 cent on them. <laughs> Real free advertisement. Oh, I'll just take that out of there for a second. Sit it there. When you got the lid open, it smells nice bin. Hmm. Very nice smelling bin. It's got a nice odor to it. Not a not that smelly rotten odor. Someone's put some nectar in here. Kitty litter. Right. Put that back in there. Go to that one, then we've got another one down there. Way down yonder. Where are you going? Oh yeah, dear. Get rid of those out of there. <laughs> I might take that bag too. Oh, I lost the wheel. <laughs> How often do you see that? So there's three bins here that lose their wheels. Whip, lost it again. Right. Whatever we got in there, I've got to try and untie that. Oh, that's another one of those things. Spin us around this way. Hit that. Down there. Just 
too much on the bottom, I can't get to it. I think I've got it all. It's a rotten mess in that one. Had to stop. They wanted a chin wag, these the couple that's just heading out now with their brakes on down way yonder. You probably can't see them. They're down there. Good old couple. They were surprised on how much I had. So I thought oh, I'll just turn the camera off, have a talk to them. They pulled up. Nice old couple. Found my screwdriver to get them undone. I salvaged the cable toy. Zippy toy. We've only got one bin to go, which is still down there. So, it is very time consuming doing this, but I want the bag too. Oh, I could have left that done up. But I don't know what's in the bottom. So. Yeah, I'm glad I undone it. No more rubbish in there as well. Food scraps. Yep. Yep or re. Empty that out. Take the bag. A new one for our glass. Wow, we'll take that for sure. Geez, we've got some stuff up the back. I'll get down and do this other one. This is an explanation for why I do what I do. Here comes the truck. He's actually emptying those behind the... There, you can see the bin going up. Back down, another one going up. That's the first three ones I've done this morning. He's on his last one. Now, when it comes to these ones up here, you watch the yellow bin one, lid one, which is supposed to be recyclable. He'll pick that up. See, up he goes, up in the top. Now he picked the others up. So where's the recycling with the truck? There's none in this park. And that's not the only bin he'll do. He'll go around the back, empty it in. So yeah. We 
Well, there you have it. You've seen how the uh, Garo bloke actually empties all the bins. Oh, those couple anyway. And like I was explaining, it's how, the, he, how he puts the yellow bin lid in with the other bins. Um, meaning no recycling at all. But anyway, getting down to what we got for the day. Uh, we started out with getting a bit of copper, uh, get a bit of copper pipe and all the little bits and pieces in there, all the hardware and stuff in there. Gonna love that, doing up our caravan at the moment. So I'm gonna need a lot of that. Um, got these as well out of there as well. Um, then we came, oh I forgot these two pieces over here. A bit of brass in that as well. Got that with all of that. Um, then came here at the park. That's where he still is. I've been waiting for this fella to come. So, he's been and gone. I can finish off our video for everyone. Um, found these pair of FXD jeans. They've actually got a hole in the crutch. So I'm just going to use them as a rag. Um, the corduroy jacket, it's a kid's one. Going to donate that. Um, that's all I can do with that. Found a candle holder for... Um, all your citronella candles, that sort of thing. I'll probably, June will probably actually melt all of this out, get the old aluminium piece out of there. I'll crush, I'll put that in a crush pile, so that'll go with that, so she can redo her candles with that. I uh, found a tin of chunky sardines too. So yeah, uh, this little thing here, I reckon it's a strain of myself. It looks like it sits up like that. It does, it probably just needs sterilising, bleaching, that sort of thing. Uh, also found one lonely egg, unbroken. So we can test that. Also a squeegee mop, still in the packet. Dry as though. So yeah, oh, and a bit of grease, a bit of grease there. Um, this is still got a lot in it. <laughs> Laundry powder. Why throw it away? Yeah. I also did find a full bottle of lemonade. I've been drinking that while I've been waiting. It was a factory sealed bottle of lemonade too. So that's a bonus. So yeah, it's been quenching my thirst, but we did get all of the cans and bottles that are underneath that. Isn't that amazing? Saving all of that from landfill. Anyway, that's me gonna sign off here I've enjoyed today really enjoyed being relaxing waiting for the truck so yeah I'm gonna see you all on the flip side everyone and don't forget to like subscribe see you in the next one I forgot to show you these they're placemats so yeah just a bit more on the end there there's three placemats they're like a rubber type of thing um, so yeah, I was packing it away and I forgot to show you those. I did get some more gas cans too. I just put one in the front. There's a whole heap in here. There's one in there that's probably full of gas. So, oh, and I forgot to get this bag. I did get this bag for the glass. Um, but never mind, I can't show everything. Can't remember everything. So, yeah. Alright. See you in the next one, everyone.